Hey guys, I Shield Twenty One fan here. All right, so I'm really into Siren. I'm really into this manga now. I've been reading it since it first came out, and I think it's just really, really cool. But I have noticed some things um, along it. I haven't gotten that far in it yet. I'm where Shonen Jump is with it. I haven't read the newest chapter, but let me point some things out. All right, Siren. Is it similar to Bleach? You might be saying, no, I don't think so. No, I'm missing, that's not it. Well, if you look carefully at the storyline of Basis, Bleach has Ichigo and Rukia. Ichigo gets his powers from Rukia. Look at Siren. Akia, right here, gets his powers, his powers from Sakurako. Now, you both have a female character, and they both give their main shonen character their powers. They are both- Aki was living a normal life, Ichigo was living a normal life. The girl comes into their life, and they get powers. And now, the girl, Sakurako and Rukia, have to teach the main shonen character how to use their powers. Rukia brings Ichigo to Soul Society, and puts him to well she doesn't really bring him to the soul society, but she like shows him to kill hollows basically. Sakurako brings him to training with uh, that one girl. I forget her name. But there's another thing. Siren has the main character and they have to train. They have to like train their butt off. I already see where this is going. It's going in the exact same direction as Bleach. First they get their powers. Then they go and fight something. They need to get stronger. They go and train. Everybody's gonna get their ass whooped. Then the main character is gonna come in and say, Oh, I'm so powerful and with the share of everybody. Then he gets the shit beat out of himself and he has to go train again. It's an endless circle. But another thing I noticed with Siren and Bleach is the artwork. Now, Bleach is a very distinct art style. In my opinion, it's lazy. As you notice, Type Kubo, I don't know if he started in this yet. No, he wasn't too lazy in the first volume of Bleach. But as it got on, he got lazy. So let me find some Bleach. Show you guys. Okay, here we go. One, you'll notice that the background in Bleach is very plain. They'll have empty spaces. Sort of. With like, no backgrounding. And I'll be very focused on one, on one character. When something happens, something dramatic happens, there's very little background. The same as with Siren. Oh no, somebody's gotten stabbed. Do you see any background? No. What about here when he's falling? Hmm? Look similar to Bleach to you? Some blood flying there, no background, all white, focus on the main character. Very similar. Also, the inking style is very similar. How Otaku Uvets USA described it was in the review of Siren, they said. Siren is very sim Siren is very similar to the American comic style of inking. Now, I'm huge American comics, and they put very heavy inking on what they do, because that is the inker's job. He puts so much detail on the inks, and then the coloring touches it up. The same is with Bleach and Siren. It's very American comic style inking, with very thick lines, and there's a lot of detail put in with the inks. And you'll recognize that in Siren. So here's Bleach. You can take a look at that art. Now I'll show you Siren. Let me if there's any similarities here. I'll just find, try and find a bit of a similar page. Okay. See that inking style? Very similar. Even the sharpness of the character's eyes are very similar to Bleach. So, in my opinion, Siren is a good manga. You can see that he's trying to fall in the footsteps of Bleach. So you got the female character give the main shonen character powers. They're gonna just fight and train, fight and train the entire series. And the art art <coughs> sorry my voice is weird. The art style is very similar also. Another thing I've noticed that Siren is similar to is Gantz, okay? Because you have these people and they're basically trying to survive in a separate world and they gain points. Same thing as Gantz. They go into a different world, Siren goes into a different world. Siren, they have to get points on the card. Gantz, they have to get points from the Gantz ball. And all trying to survive. And new people are introduced every time, and new people can be killed off. I don't know, maybe it's just a coincidence, but I think Siren is a good manga, but it's getting bringing ideas from a lot of different series.